please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for 30 seconds of silence. Good morning, Coyotes, and welcome back to another weather broadcast brought to you by the Meteorology Association. For this week's temperatures, we're going to be ranging from the low 60s to the mid 60s. It's going to be kind of warm in the morning, and then we're going to still be at the colder temperatures at night from the 30s to the upper 40s, which is not so bad, actually. For this week's precipitation, we got not that much of a chance. The humidity is going to be generally 29% to 53%. General wind speeds from 5 to 6 miles per hour, and the drought will stay the same, abnormally dry to moderately dry. An interesting fact is that 2023 was the hottest record year ever recorded, and it's predicted that 2024, this year, will be much hotter. I hope that's not the case because it's a high probability, but prayers that it won't be that way. If you have any questions, you can email me here. And that will be all for this week's weather broadcast. Now back to your regularly scheduled broadcast. Good morning, Coyotes. It's time for the rundown. January is National Mentoring Month. National Mentoring Month celebrates in mentoring and the positive effect it can have on young lives. Do you have a teacher, Southwest staff member, or a student who is making a positive difference in mentoring others? Scan the link to submit a mentor who is making a difference. Give a Southwest shout out. Hey, Southwest. HOSA is hosting their next blood drive on January 19th from 7 a.m. to 12 p.m. Only students age 17 plus are allowed to donate while also meeting certain height and weight requirements. For seniors, earn an additional cord for graduation, you must donate twice. There will be one more blood drive for the school year, making that your final opportunity to participate. Penny Wars is almost over. It ends on Friday the 19th. Programs with the most points will get cookies and ice cream sandwiches. Hurry up and bring in your loose change to the front office or in the cafeteria on Friday. The graphic here shows how the game will be played. Who will be crowned champion of our first penny war? Calling all gamers, strategists, and team players to an exciting opportunity with the competitive gaming club. Are you interested in esports? Want to be a part of a dynamic team and compete against schools across the, the region? Well, here's your chance to join the action. Competitive Gaming Club is holding its spring season recruitment meeting on Thursday, January 18th from 10.40 p.m. in the room C126. This meeting is open to everyone, whether you're a veteran gamer or new to the scene. We're looking for players to join our existing teams and even form new ones. So if you have a passion for games like Rocket League, Super Smash Bros, and Splatoon 3, Madden, and more, we want to meet you. So mark your calendars for January 18th, 10.40 p.m. Don't miss out on the chance to be a part of your spring season lineup. We can't wait to welcome new faces and talents to our team. Polynesian Club will be meeting in Mrs. Gouchard's room, C101, on Wednesday, January 17th. Come join us to learn about Polynesian dance, foods, and much more. Meetings run from 1.45 to 2.45. Snacks will be provided. See you there! Hey seniors, there will be an informational meeting about the senior trip to Disneyland in April on Tuesday, January 16th from 1.45 to 2.15 in the cafeteria. Further information about the trip, including cost, payment options, eligibility, and other specific information will be shared during this meeting. See you there. That's it for today, Coyotes. Hope you have a great rest of your week, and we'll see you back here tomorrow.